Thank you, Steph. An update now on the controversial speed zone cameras in Capital City school zones. The cameras are back online and issuing tickets. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen joins us now live in studio with what this means for drivers. Steve? Well, Mike, these cameras were turned off in early July after the General Assembly approved legislation requiring that the tickets only be issued on days when school is in session. The cameras were reactivated at the start of this school year, but the controversial program has only been giving 30 day warning tickets. The 15 cameras are all located within a quarter mile of a school. The city added five new cameras this year and relocated some of the existing ones. They're active between 7 a.m. and 6 p.m. on school days. Drivers caught traveling more than 11 miles per hour over the posted speed limit will be ticketed $50 per violation. And today we heard from one driver who thinks this fine is actually not enough. They're the ones speeding. They know it's a school zone, so they should definitely get hit with a fine. $50? Okay, it's $50, but I think maybe it should have been up a little bit higher just because. Now, between January and June, the city issued more than 36,000 speeding tickets. Officials later agreed to partially refund thousands of drivers to settle a federal class action lawsuit that challenged the program. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.